carrying a lot of weight here. Ah. Carrying a lot of weight. Let's go on down the road here, but nobody interrupts us. Yeah. Dip in the road. Yeah, long time coming. Very old, long time. Baby, baby. Baby, baby, baby. baby. Long ass time. A long time. If I could run full speed, I would have got that mute fruit bush out there. Okay, right on down here, there should be a bridge going across. And right across that thing is my destination. Right in the middle of the road, no cars coming. There are no cars that operate in this time. It's okay. Gentle stream of consciousness down the road. I like all this fallout, quote unquote. Oh boy. My ankles. Yep. The land's kind of taking over this part of the road here. Yeah. Look at these cars, run down, rested up. The paint's barely surviving on this one. Barely, I must use some good paint, huh? Pile the leaves, old bus, just chilling. They took off those wheels a long time ago, eh? I think the bridge might be over here somewhere. Ah, there it is, Sunshine Tidings Co-op. That's one of my bases, that's what I'm heading to. I gotta deck it out a bit, I want people to live there. It's very empty. It's so empty that my robot here, uh, Cogsworth, Codsworth, hey there, Codsworth, behind me. Uh, he comments on how spooky the place is because it's so empty. I thought he was speaking about the zombies that we killed earlier, but uh, now he's just talking about how currently creepy it is. Look at this intersection. The road's almost gone here. In another hundred years. <laughs> You wouldn't have civilization anymore. Stuff like this metal, this is going to take a bit to go away. You can tell it really wants just to fade away into history. Crumble apart. These pieces, you know. Keeps getting knocked off, deteriorated. But that binding's really in there, you know. That wood sure is rotted and dry. Well, here we are. Here's the bridge I was talking about. GNN, the best programming. That's, it must be the... Uh, people are fighting. I heard gunfire. Okay, 25 miles per hour. We're not going to have a problem with that, are we? Huh? Eh. Yeah. Keep on going. Easing on down the road. Almost there. Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh, Luke. Woo, that's a good one. Yeah, things you gotta do to keep your mind off of this desolation. <laughs> hey, C Codsworth. Hey. Sir. You got any water or anything for me? Hey, Codsworth. There you go. Oh, thank you. He gives me this purified water all the time. And tells me some good jokes and stuff and feelings. So, uh, hey, Codsworth, how do you feel right now? What you thinking about? Your thoughts? The bartender says, We don't serve faster than light particles in here. A tachyon walks into the bar. That is good. That is good. Because uh, tech and particles are proposed to move backwards in time. Because they go faster than light, supposedly, and backwards. Crazy, man. Crazy. I like it. Keep it up. You get them good jokes. Got them good jokes. Give me the yuck yucks. Good job, dude. With that whistling. Whistling, baby. Look at the lake down there. There might be murloc babies and some eggs. Easing on down the road. It's like a real walk, you know? It's like a real walk in reality. In the other place, the other earth realm, the flesh land of the, of the, of the flesh beings. What is this? Oh, watch out for the debris. All that debris up in my legs. 
All up in my leg holes, got the debris. Let's check out this side of the bridge. Yeah, uh, I killed some mutants over here a while a while ago. Do you hear that? What was that? I heard something. All that sludge in the water. Oh me, oh my. Yeah, there's a guy that uh, went and duty stank in his pants, and he always talks about how bad he's... Oh, look at all those eggs! Uh. And there's rad stags? Okay, so I need to go down there and get that deer after I, I drop off this load. So I'm going to drop off the load at, at the base over there, get the eggs and the deer. They're moving. They're migrating. Oh, I need the rad stags, man. Make my way on into my co-op. Drop off the stuff, get the eggs, do a loop around the lake really quick, and uh, head back up there and get a radio tower up and running, along with uh, you know power for the radio tower, make sure there's food and water, and uh, enough beds. There's certainly enough houses. And some turrets, of course, some defenses. Well, I guess the uh, defensive positions. I don't need turrets necessarily. I just need the uh, the bunkers for them settlers to stay behind. Yep. We're almost there. Still see the rad stags down. You're mine, rad stags. A bunch of eggs, which means there's a bunch of deadly murloc beasts down below. We'll be having some combat shortly, baby. I'm ready. I know Codsworth is ready. He loves combat. He's a spicy meatball. A spicy meatball. Oh, up the hill we go. This part of the road is all gone right here. Land took over this entire situation. Pretty cool. There's a road hidden here somewhere. Uh, we're almost there. Yeah, this whole area used to be a road, I think. Now it's not. Okay, we're almost there. Oh, hub flower. Hub flower. Thank you. Whee! A long walk, I tell you. A long walk in the day. In that day. Alleyoop. Alleyoop. Doop. Doop. Gotta kill that rad stack. I'm allergic to this grass here. Man. I don't know if it's the radiation or just all this dust from the lack of green vegetation, but this place does something to my nose. Sunshine Tidings Co-op. So I put one little thing here. and I, Oh yeah, I planted a bunch of food. Uh, I didn't build a tower yet, but I put some water up. All that food there. Okay. Hey there, robot. 